How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games. Uh, before we get into today's Daz Watchers, uh, I just want to say a couple of things. Uh, yesterday, my daughter had a birthday party. It went really well. It went great. And uh, one of the young girls who was there uh, came to me with some information. Uh, she was asking for help uh, for some friends of hers. Uh, basically, uh, she told me about um, about a man called Neil, who is very ill right now, has been uh, diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. And to get the treatment that he needs, he basically has to be flown out of the UK to a medical facility in Israel where they are currently doing groundbreaking work with stem cell treatment. And uh, th this this type of uh, MS, I believe it's called. There's, there's basically uh, no, no treatment here in the UK for this percentage of uh, people who have the progressive type that uh, Neil has. People who have gone and had this treatment apparently have uh, had it completely stopped. They've seen their condition uh, stop. She asked me if I could maybe use my channel uh, to, to basically advertise the GoFundMe page so this family can get Neil the help that he needs. So far, so far they've raised nearly £23,000 out of a £90,000 goal to help him uh, get to Israel safely with all the treatment that he needs and to then undergo the treatment which uh, could apparently save his life. Apparently using uh, stem cell technology and a mixture of chemotherapy, uh, people have actually become MS free from uh, this, this condition. Apparently, the treatment's been going around for years. I myself haven't heard of it, but um, it's all there in the GoFundMe page. You can read Neil's story. And I just thought this was a great opportunity to see if we can raise some money uh, for, a, for a family uh, in need right now. This guy this guy needs uh, the treatment. So, you know, let, let's see if we can help this family out. I, I said to the young girl at this party uh, yesterday that I would... Um, I would put it at the beginning of one of my videos uh, to see if we can get this guy the treatment that uh, he needs. So if you do want to donate uh, and help this this family out, there is a link in the description below. It will take you to the GoFundMe page. They've already raised a significant amount of money for Neil. If we could make if we could make that happen, that'd be great. You know, I I, have, I love using this channel for, for positivity and, you know, for helping people out. So, let, let, let's, uh, if you're interested, link in the description below. I wish Neil and his family all the best, and I'll be keeping an eye on this uh, as as you guys donate. And, yeah, I, I, hope, I hope I can help in some way. Let's get on with today's video. How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games and another Daz Watches. Uh, I literally tweeted out, like, send me a weird video for me to watch, and I won't research it. I'll just, like, save it for later. And I've been saving it for a rainy day, so I'm gonna I'm gonna watch this video that was sent to me, uh, and it's called Crazy People Making Pig Noises. <laughs> That's it! <laughs> so, I hope there's more to it than that, but it's, like, three minutes long. Let, let's, let's watch it. This car, Seymour, Illinois. All right. Okay, off the bat, he's wearing a corn hat. Farmers are fucking weird, man. You know, that <laughs> that they just you just have to be a certain type of person to be a farmer. You know, I'm not saying they all walk around with corn hats. I want a corn hat. That they're all out there on their own, they're working, you know, on on the farms and stuff. They get very like little interaction with the outside world. <laughs> it's not that bad. I'm overreacting, but <laughs> farmers are just a special breed of people. Right over here. What the fuck was that? What? Was that? Was that supposed to be a pig? He sounded like a woman in trouble. I need to see that again. I don't understand this. Freddy! Fred! I think I see him. He's right over here. I need to see a fucking therapist! So his impression of a pig was BOO! <laughs> I, I, let me tell you, right? Let me tell you some shit! I have never been to a farm or an area with pigs. I've never seen a pig ever in my life. 
go POO! Like, what? I don't understand. It just, I, I, man, this is like a talent show for this, isn't it? That's what this is. This is a fucking talent show. Come on, pig. Piggy. Come on, piggy. Clapping? That was the most horrific sound I've ever heard. That that's like something out of Silent Fucking Hill. Do they know what a pig is? Like, do they actually have they actually spent time around pigs? <laughs> that sounded like a curse. That didn't sound like a fucking pig or any animal that I know. Man, if a pig was making that sort of noise, I'd take it to the vet. Can I try that? No, that was a bird. <laughs> I, if there's any talent shows out there, all right, with bird calls, <laughs> you know your boy here is going to be able to do it. So I've actually grew up in this city, so but I actually studied this and watched it and watched it. So we'll see how well I do today. Our man here, I don't know what his name is, has studied this, okay? He's an expert, observed the pig in its natural environment, and he's made out that he's a big shot. Let's see his pig impression. I, I really think these people need to go to a farm. <laughs> seen a pig count and go Sue Sue <laughs> That is one fabulous pig Fabulous Or is that like a pig call? Cause they're all doing that noise aren't they? I think that's a pig call. I think that's how you get pigs to come to you. I'm gonna remember that. <laughs> I want to say that that was, you know, the best out of all of them, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> this is fucking stupid. It's so stupid. And his celebration at the end, look, like... It was like, yeah, could have done better, but yeah, nailed it. Made it, mum. <laughs> is there another one? People are just sitting there clapping when this woman clearly needs some help. <laughs> what? I, that was that was terrifying. Her expressions were terrifying. I hope she doesn't own pig. Like pigs won't even come to that. They run the fuck off. If I was a pig, there's no way I'd. Oh, there's my owner. I'd be gone. It, oh my god. Did you just say? I like to get dirty. I like to get dirty. Does does her pig that she's doing an impersonation of have Tourette's? <laughs> That's all, folks. I've seen some shit, you know. When you when you watch 
when you watch as many videos as I do, you see some shit. Okay? Right, so this is a real pig sound right now that you're about to listen to. This is a pig. <laughs> Sounds like the seventh layer of hell, okay? That's a pig! Alright, this is our contestants. Pig! This bitch! It's not a pig! <laughs> it really made me laugh, and it scared me, kind of hurt my ear a little bit. But, you know, I'll live. I wish these people the best of luck in the future. I'm not sure how far their talent will take them, but um, it's, it's a talent nonetheless. Like Love Crest, my channel! If you're gonna do a pig impression, actually do it right! And I will see you in the next video. Stay dazzling.